This morning, the man who crashed a U-Haul truck into barriers near the White House is accused of making threats to the president or vice president. U.S. Park Police saying the man was arrested overnight, and the charges associated with the incident include assault with a dangerous weapon, reckless driving, and threatening to kill, kidnap, or inflict harm on a president, vice president, or family member. This video posted overnight showing a U-Haul truck slamming into barriers at Lafayette Square, a block away from the White House. Investigators removing a flag with a swastika from the scene. Officials say shortly before 10 p.m. Monday, officers with the Secret Service Uniform Division detained the driver after the collision. This comes as the White House has beefed up security measures after a number of security breaches in Washington in recent years, including the January 6 riots at the Capitol. And it doesn't appear as though the president or his family was in any danger as a result of this incident. And thankfully, no Secret Service personnel or White House officials were hurt. And the, and the suspect in this case was quickly detained. Hoda? All right, Ryan Nobles for us there at the White House. Ryan, thank you.